First okay. things first. First things first. Oh, what, what do you oh. mean? I've got green on. A small amount of green. Just I didn't catch pinch. any skin. <laughs> Just pinch, a pinch <laughs> of the blazer. Uh, Mike Yanni is boycotting wearing green today. I'm okay. I got, I got beads. Oh, you got beads. Oh, okay, good. You're good safe. One. You're safe. Okay, okay so uh, Mike's here, <laughs> obviously. Like social it. media check-in time. Um, we're going to get to why Andy's so excited in a few seconds, but first you want to talk about IKEA and hide-and-seek. IKEA is stamping out fun, apparently. What? According to some people online, uh, they're saying no to hide-and-seek in their stores. Why? Well, so the story goes, last July, <laughs> last summer, uh, IKEA said yes to a 29-year-old Belgium girl who wanted to play hide-and-seek in one of the stores. It was her 30 things to do before she's 30. Okay. IKEA said yes. This picture was taken from that day. 500 people showed up. She played hide-and-seek with 500 people. It, was, it went off well. Excellent, right? Well, now Facebook pages have been set up for more games. Right. Okay? So random there's actual games. Hide, it's a great idea. Yeah, random game, games. But look at this hide and seek at a key. There are actually rules on Facebook. Normal clothes, you can only hide in open displays, you can't hide in the washroom employees only. So there's pages set up, yeah. plus pages set up as well for mass games. The point is, some of these games. Are 32,000 people big? Oh, wow. So IKEA is saying, "I'm sorry, we realize you guys want to have fun, but think about it, that's only the capacity of McMahon Stadium." Yeah, no So kidding. IKEA put out a, uh, a spokesperson and said, uh, "It's hard to control. We need to make sure people are safe in our stores, and that's hard to do if we don't even know where they are." <laughs> valid points. Valid points. Uh, so they're saying, "Please, no mass games of hide and seek." Oh Isn't that gosh. how many people go there on a Sunday anyway? Pretty much. Yeah. It would be, the, it would be the ultimate hide and seek location. Yeah. No Seriously. Because right, you can always move too. Mm -hmm. yeah. This is the video <laughs> that's that already Andy plotting his game so of excited about. Yeah. What is this? Yeah, okay. Watch this video uh, going viral. Apparently, you can open a bottle of beer with a piece of paper. Oh, so you fold it a couple of times? Fold it. It looks like four times. Okay. So you make it nice and. Uh, I guess tough, and then you fold it over once again. Oh, and then you fold it back. Okay, and then... Oh, you're taking notes. Wow. It's a good party trick. The question is, can you do it? Does yeah. It, have you tried so, it? No, I have not tried it. Okay. So I'm just folding up the piece of paper right now. They were making the creases pretty sharp, just so you know. I folded it four times. Yeah, and, they, and then so they fold it again. One more okay. time. Do one more. No, but they... And then they no, fold yeah, it halfway. Then, yeah. Where did that beer come from? I don't know. <laughs> Somebody's desk? I have no idea. Who's that? Somebody's desk? just showed up. <laughs> Who's the beer fairy? Okay, so I fold it again. I think you have to use now, the uh, I you, think well, other to... side. Other side, isn't it? Yeah. Ted's gonna, Ted's gonna coach you. And then. Oh, I see. Oh. Go for it. Get in there. Oh! Oh, oh I heard, heard it. I heard it. Look, the bubbles are moving. Okay. Pretty close. Like, but I ripped the paper. Oh, okay. It's close. I bet you. I don't know. It must be it's a thicker possible. grain you paper. Fold it again? I usually just do this. And yeah. It works. Okay. <laughs> That's what I do with the hotel rooms. <laughs> Last but not least, uh, I know everyone's tired of Frozen and the Frozen videos no. and all that kind of stuff, right? No. No, we love Frozen. This video is worth watching. Dueling pianos, Frozen style. Sister Sarah and Jason put this video together more than a quarter of a million views just in a couple of days. So, okay, talented pianists, right? Yeah. yeah of backwards. Yeah. Um, and now they want to get on Ellen. They're saying, share this video. And it's not just because it's backwards. Watch. They're really talented. She's rocking Listen the Elsa to brain, too. I Listen like it. To that. It's awesome. Good job. Oh, they they're amazing. Tiana, they, of course they do. Yeah. I'm sure she'll come cool. to that. Cool. I'm sure she will. They can come on our show. They Open are invite. Welcome. More than welcome. Practice your beer opening skills and your high kicking skills. <laughs> where, where are you hanging out today wearing your beads? I might take off the beads because I might be dancing with the Blakey uh, School of Irish Dance. Do you hear what Andy wants you to put on? Curls. No. The curls, the TR. The curls, and the TR. Wear the curls. Maybe today they do. Maybe today. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure about that. Also, Lynn Crawford joining us here in studio a little bit later. Stay with us. 627. You're watching Breakfast Television. Hey, you got oh, it. Oh, you popped.